So we're going to go over how to change our sanding belt on a 558. First thing you're going to want to do is follow all of your lockout, tag out procedures. And when you climb on in, you should be able to access everything you need through our access panel. I've gone ahead and removed our dust collection and our main guard just for visibility purposes here. So the first thing we're going to want to do is locate our wing nuts. We're going to find one on either side of our motor assembly. Next, we're going to loosen these wing nuts here, giving ourselves enough room to swing our motor assembly back towards us. With the wing nuts loosened, we should be able to pivot our motor assembly, relieving the tension on our sanding belt. And when we have our new sanding belt, we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna pivot our motor forward, giving ourselves enough room to replace that belt. And we're gonna let it pivot back into place, putting tension back on our sanding belt. With our new sanding belt on, all we're going to have to do is resecure our wing nuts. So again, I have removed a few pieces here, our dust collection and our main guard. You're going to be able to access everything that we just touched through the access panel. I just removed some of these to give you a better look at what's going on.